With vaccine distributions well underway and more in the pipeline, people are wondering when is it possible to reach herd immunity here in New Mexico, especially if kids can't be vaccinated yet? It's a question News 13's Gabrielle Burkhart asked Dr. Scrace. Nearly one year into the pandemic, New Mexicans are finally feeling some of the weight of COVID restrictions ease up. We're doing pretty good. The numbers are going down. I'm very hopeful. It feels good to see more people out. It just, uh, it's weird to see uh, the everywhere you go desolate like a ghost town. But for life to return to a pre-pandemic normal, health officials have talked about reaching herd immunity, where a majority of the population is protected against COVID, either with a vaccine or natural antibodies after contracting the virus. There's a, kind of a debate in the scientific community about how many people have to have immunity to have herd immunity. Folks are talking 70, 80 percent. New Mexico's population is about 2.1 million people. So far, roughly 16 percent of the population has had at least one dose of the vaccine, and nearly 9 percent has tested positive for COVID. When you add all those up, there's roughly a two to one ratio of the from the cases we don't know about to the cases we do. Adding potential unconfirmed cases means more than 40% of New Mexico's population could have some immunity. Is it possible to reach herd immunity in New Mexico without being able to vaccinate kids yet? Since kids make up roughly 15 to 20 percent of the state's population, Dr. Scray says it is possible to reach herd immunity if more adults get vaccinated soon. I would say, though, that I think we're really hopeful. And studies on a longer lasting immunity after contracting COVID are also proving hopeful. We are seeing people who do get reinfected, but it's a small number. Gabrielle Burkhart, KRQE News 13. Now, the state and CDC guidelines still encourage anyone who has had COVID to get a vaccine, but to wait 90 days to get the shot. The National Institutes of Health say immunity after recovering from COVID, they think, lasts about eight months.